well we're going to make this very beautiful blooming lotus look at the play of light and shadows in this for making this you require 12 strips of paper 30 centimeters long 1 centimeters wide they can be magenta and green colors fold all the strips along the midline so you get these centers then place a magenta strip apply glue on the center and two points adjacent to the center and strip one across and one on the right of the center the other on the left of the center now apply glue again you can upturn the papers apply glue again on both sides of the mid strip and stick two more magenta strips so essentially you're going to make a cross using three strips standing and there'll be three strips lying down now apply glue in the center and four points and stick the center of the green strip right in the middle apply glue and stick another green strip like a multiplication sign now again apply glue and stick one strip to the right of the green middle one and one to the left of the middle green strip you got to do the same to the other strip apply some glue and place stick two more green strips now you can see the pattern is quite the pattern of the magenta strips and the green strips is quite similar only that the uh, green strips are just phased out by 45 degrees up turn the model and on all the right top strips magenta strips apply a dab of glue now take two magenta strips and stick them to make a petal or a loop and you've got to make four such magenta loops then take the middle of the green strips and place them on top of these petals the magenta petals apply little dabs of glue on the tips of the magenta petals and then stick the green strips to them we're going to repeat the same thing with the green strips now apply glue once again on the top right of four green petals green strips and stick two green strips to make a petal you have to make four such loops or petals using green strips apply glue on their tips lift up the magenta strips and stick them on the tips of the green petals now this would complete the blooming lotus you can see a very symmetric pattern it's like a woven beautiful pattern this is the underbelly of the lotus now you take a small lamp light it and place it in the center of course you can decorate the lotus with small colored beads place a lighted lamp in the middle and just wait for the night and it would look absolutely exquisite look at the play of light and shadows it's absolutely gorgeous